Hi guys, it's Dr. E. Today we're gonna go ahead and learn how to make a front man mask from Squid Game. Let's go ahead and take a look. So go to this particular guy because you don't need supports. There's several other ones, but uh, you may need support, and this way you don't have to use the support. And go ahead and download the files, uh, load it up on your slicer. I'm using Perusa slicer, by the way. So let's go ahead and load up the file. So this particular file have three different ones, thicker ones, thin, and wide. I'm gonna actually print the wide one uh, because uh, I wanna make, it, make sure it fits my face. I printed some of the other ones earlier and it didn't work out for me. It was uh, too narrow. So let's go and load this up. And you can see, you can print this without any supports, which is really nice. Uh, looks pretty good. We're gonna go ahead and actually just print it a little bit bigger if we can. The uh, scale factor of one, 105, because uh, I think my face is a little bit bigger. So let's actually print it 110. A little bigger, I think, better than a little too small. So I'm going to print it at 110. I'm going to actually have it quality at infill 15%. Infill won't matter so much on item like this because the walls are so thin. There's not really any infills. Uh, it's going to take 11 hours. And let's go ahead and print it out and say how it, it comes out. I did print out two of these of uh, the first model actually didn't fit so I had to actually shrink it just 1% um, even though I didn't shrink it that much the mask did not fit me well it, it was too narrow now I try to print this out larger the first version on my Perusa MK 3s plus but the problem was that it would take like a whole day because of the extra supports now I did find another version of this mask on thingies verse um that's this one here that i don't need to put supports supports are the stuff that to support uh, certain things that stick out when you 3d print um so i was able to print this one at 110 percent i uh it fit me actually too perfect and uh where the eyes are it actually hits me when i put it on myself so i added a little piece of tape and some stuff on top of it so it creates a little bit of room in the forehead now it fits perfectly and I'm ready to go scare the kids. Anyway, have a great day, guys. Subscribe, like, and bye. That was Dr. E.